the YouTuber and streamer known as Vaj is one of the weirdest individuals on the platform. If anyone else would be saying this kind of stuff, they will label him as a, you know, as a 445. But for whatever reason, it's not that big of a deal. And in case you guys don't know, Vaj is a political YouTuber. He has around 470,000 subscribers. I've heard of him before. Never watched his content. Don't care for it. I don't dislike him because of his political takes. I just dislike him as a person. I think he said and done some very unique and interesting things that if anyone else from the other political spectrum would have said, he would have been on their ass about it. He seems to be able to get away with saying the most disgusting out of pocket stuff. And no, this is not me cutting clips out of context. Guys, we need to legalize CP. Guys, we need TP in our life. Well, who's we? <laughs> You know, not everyone's a sick, degenerate, porn addict loser like you are. If I got hit by a car and I turned into a vegetable and Vosh started playing on YouTube via autoplay, I would make the strongest comeback of any vegetable before. I'm standing up on my two feet and I'm turning that shit off. And if you follow me on Twitter, which if you don't, please do. I will love you forever. I tweeted, lock Vosh up for live. Brother is nasty. Sensitive. Stop yapping. Tell us what happened. I just wanted to give you guys a little context. This is what happened. You can see this is an example of the kind of structure that I'm referring to. Oh! Now, of course, it's censored because if I showed you what that folder had, not folder, multiple folders had, this video will be taken down. I'll get terminated, all that good stuff. So he had three different folders and in some of them he had corn, he had lolly. And in case you guys don't know what a lolly con is, it's just this Japanese type of corn that um that has very young girls and whether it's legal or not to have is a very thin line there's a lot of conversation about it i personally think it's disgusting it's something that i'm not into i will never watch i'd rather cut my dick off and eat it than to ever ever watch something that disgusting in my life to specifically fictional depictions of characters whose body proportions closely resemble that of a child japanese drawn characters that might look like they're 10 but in reality they're like 2000 years old so it's okay to jerk off to them if you're sending pornography or explicit images like these to your computer i think you might need help dog you're addicted at that point point. and with these following clips i'm not so shocked he's into lolly it is possible for an adult and a child to have a sexual relationship and for it to have positive outcomes on the child as well. That is possible. Like um, zoo file, like drawn stuff, it should be 100% legal. In fact, and this is gonna be a real hot take, I have yet to hear a convincing moral or legal argument as to why possession of child pornography should be illegal. Actual child pornography. Yeah, and I wonder why he's so into Sue files or not into. Well, I mean, they get kind of tricky there. So in those folders, I'm gonna just explain it as PG as I can, of girls that look like they were like nine years old and horses doing it with the girls. Degenerate shit. Like your brain has to be so fucking fried for you to get off that. Normal people don't even interest you. Just imagine how much porn one needs to consume to get to the point where you're like, a woman, not hot. And I believe Vosh is married as well. So, you know, that's great. You're like, women, no more. You know what I'm gonna get into? Lowly girls and horses. It makes sense why he defended Sue Files. And in case you guys don't know, a Sue File is a person who's attracted to an animal. I've made infinite videos on these freaks on Twitter. So it looks like he's pro that. Why is no one making a bigger deal out of this like this guy's fully admitting would i be surprised if vosh had cp on his computer no i will not be surprised one bit i'll be like come on there's two outcomes to this even three one he's just a fucking loser whose brain is so fried on porn that this is all genuine and he believes everything he's saying two he's an fbi fed trying to lure people in infiltrating certain communities so they could catch degenerate freaks or three he's just a fucking disgusting pedophile and he's trolling but what would anyone pretend to be a pedophile like i get trolling but what would anyone troll with oh yeah i like little kids i don't think cp should be banned why should that be illegal? I think Sue Files should be okay. Like maybe the first time you said it, I'll be like, okay, that's you know kind of dark, but I guess it's a joke. But when you constantly repeat it and then your folder gets leaked, 
are you joking or are you trying to tell us something here i do think he's a fucking sick individual and i would feel much safer leaving my kits with edp 445 than with vosh at least edp is straight up honest about it and his intentions but with vosh he's always like i'm kidding i'm trolling satire wait it's real oh, wait wait my folder just got leaked oh wait i have like 20 gigabytes of loli on my computer and what else does he have on his computer you know what i mean or in his phone this guy is so weird and once again, I don't care about his politics. He could agree with shit I do. And I would still be like, yeah, this guy's fucking weird. He did respond to this. And I haven't seen anyone cope this hard in a minute. The other one um, is like a threesome with two chicks and a guy. And in retrospect, looking at it, knowing now that that artist is a lolicon, yeah, I can see it. When I looked at it, I think the vibe that I got was like short stack thick kind of thing. You know what I mean? Uh, like the way uh, like goblins get drawn in porn. You'll, you'll have to entertain me for a moment on this presumed shared knowledge of how goblins get drawn in pornography. But you know how they're all like thick short stacks, right? Oh yeah, you know, my favorite genre, goblin. Oh yeah, you know that, I, I, I was looking for something else. I was looking for goblin. <laughs> Just admit it, you're a loser who's addicted to porn. This person says he's such a coward and his fans pretend like he's some super genius leader. He's just a porn addict. From the clips I've seen on Twitter today, he's always referencing or he's always talking about porn in some way because that's how fucked up he is. When you are defending and justifying owning CP, I think that's the point where you need to stop. If you think adults having sexual relationships with minors doesn't affect the kid and that should happen i think you need to be thrown in jail vosh seems like the type of guy to jerk off like 20 times per day this person says there was literally a horse everyone saw the sources there's no point in denying it degenerate and shameful you know they're all big short stacks right yeah vosh we all know what you mean everyone is clearly addicted to porn as much as you are Half he has 470 thousand subscribers blows my mind it just shows you that any retard can make it on youtube <laughs> Not addressing it would have been better for him, lol. Gotta love how pathetic this makes him look. He's just trying to cover his tracks. Oh no, it, it wasn't that. It wasn't little Japanese girls with, with multiple men. It, it, it was goblins, <laughs> okay? <laughs> like, like, I don't like to slander people, but is calling him a pedophile that far-fetched? And then someone made this edit. It is possible for an adult and a child to have a sexual relationship and for it to have positive outcomes on the child as well. That is possible. You know, there's files, right, who buy child. Would you say they should not be held responsible for doing that? Yes. Really? Even though mm -hmm. they're directly supporting child rape? Yeah. Consuming child illegal? I think that that would be, yes, more legal and more ethically consistent. Yes. Still don't care. I still think that, like, um, zoophile porn, like drawn stuff, should be 100% legal. In fact, and this is going to be a real hot take, I have yet to hear a convincing moral or legal argument as to why possession of child should be illegal. Actual child. At this point, I want to ask you guys something. Everyone who's watching, the thousands of people who are going to be watching this, I want to ask you something directly. Let's say you had a daughter. Who would you feel it will be safer with? Let's say there's a new Marvel movie. Actually, no one watches Marvel anymore. Let's say there was a good movie playing. Who would you rather leave your kit with? ADP 445? Or Vosh. Uh, let me know. <laughs> Either way, you're completely screwed up. But because it's Vosh and he's a socialist, no one really seems to care. Which is crazy to me. The double standards are definitely real. And he's been talking about this for years. So you can only imagine the fucked up shit he's watched. And just thinking about it makes me want to fucking throw up, Jesus. If you're whacking it off to goblins, you've gone too far. Fortune found the images Vosh had saved and it was not mistaken for goblin. It doesn't take a genius to know he was lying. He was just trying to get out of this one. Oh, my bad. I didn't know I downloaded a CP. Sorry about that. I'll do better next time. He might have the best politics ever. He might have the worst politics ever. He might be the best at arguing, even though he lies. I don't give a fuck, okay? I simply don't give a fuck. He's a fucking weirdo. He's a freak. He's disgusting. Can anyone raid his home computer? Check his hard drives. But with that said, before I lose my mind, I'm gonna stop it right here. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe with notifications on. I drop videos every single day. Stay safe and don't turn into him. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Peace out.